Imro State Police Commander said that armed men in the early hours of on Saturday bombed the Injaba police station, destroying a part of the building. However, they said two of the hoodlums were killed and their operational vehicles recovered while the rest escaped. The police public relations officer in the state command, CSP Mike Abatam, in a statement on Saturday, said that on July 31st, about 1.20 a.m., a convoy of bandits moving towards Njabatan to launch an attack, but were intercepted by the operational rest of peace team of the Nigerian police, Imu State Command. The statement said that in the ensuring fire fight one of their operational vehicle was destroyed and two of them killed while the remaining ones ran into the bush however i said while searching the vehicle one ak-47 rifle was recovered with two rounds of live ammunition and a locally made double barrel pistol with two expanded cartridges they donated an improvised explosive devices into the parking lot of a nearby Injaba police station causing damage. The statement added, he stressed that a, a cardon and a search exercise was going on in the area to apprehend the fleeing suspects. Unknown gunmen are Fulani terrorists. Government bandits and talks to instigate violence and tart it IPOB. We know your, your strategy. If this gunman has refused to run away from Imo State, that is something else. Hmm. Honestly, soldiers and police, then federal government should act as a father. Nigerians are reacting. This is not something to celebrate. I am saying this based on some comment made by some gullible warmongers here because the, the, the deceased policemen are members of the poor masses and maybe they are the breadwinners of their families. Maybe they both kiss their kids goodbye before leaving for office to fend for what the case will survive on with. Now they are diseased as a result of a bad government. A bad government caused by bad leaders that were elected by the same masses that are victimized. Who is at fault now? Oh, someone just dropped that. Return of the saints, we will express shock to the events but police should return back to their legitimate duty as no mercy has been restored to the affected area we the government citizens we fish out the perpetrators on facebook thank you wow this is a nigerian's reaction that is funny though all right someone said fulani has been at it again no abakiri if we come out from idp camp angry youth we hand you over to FBI because you are now a Yahoo policeman. The Nigerian police personnel have become an endangered spies. Federal government should declare state of emergency in Imo State based on the unlawful art of IPOB. Someone dropped that. Gunmen are different organizations from IPOB and ESN. What people don't understand is that there are so many groups in Nigeria looking for liberations and freedom, but people from the north attributed everything happening in the east to IPOP and everything happening in the in the south was as Igbo. Everyone in this country called Nigeria need fresh hair to breathe. People are already dying out of frustration and governments are only interested in election. 2023. I have said it before that it's northern bandits that are killing people and soldiers in the east. Anyways, thank God they are killing those who deserve it. Some unreasonable elements are happy about the disaster that just happened. If care is not being taken, that happy you do many times to cry because 
That is the beginning of Boko Haram in the north. When they started killing police and security agents, people were happy, but eventually turned to cried. May Almighty Allah protect an innocent people. Please, dialogue is better. Let's stop wasting lives, please. You have failed to resign and join ESN. Accept our condolence, but police should return back to their legitimate duty as normalcy has been restored to the affected area. We, the citizens, will fish out the perpetrators very soon. All right, someone said, unknown gunmen should leave police alone and focus on politicians that is sending police on that duty job with their evil money. The return of unknown gunmen part two. Nigerian army and police through their a mother out from two-story building. All right, okay, let me take it again. Nigerian police and army through Fela's mother out of two-story building. They killed everything that moves in Odi and Zaki Ibem. They killed more than 1,000 Shaiti Muslims. Draw, during Python dance, they killed thousands of IPOP members. They killed youth at Lekki. This is terrorists. Very good. I believe that what has happened to them, they will start learning sense. Someone just dropped that. Okay, people celebrating this kind of news are mindless and senseless and blame, blameless. How can you be killing those that are suffering the same thing with you? And you are happy. Is it the height? This is just the height of the wickedness to celebrate the killing of our brothers in the armed forces. These are Nigerian's reactions. So guys, I'm dropping it here. Kindly hit the comment section and don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Thank you very much. Bye for now.